Hey everyone, this is my unboxing of the Pivo Silver Equestrian Edition. And I have a helper here. His name is Bandit and he's a Whippet. He's going to be overseeing things today, making sure I don't screw anything up. So, uh, with the Equestrian Edition here, we have the tripod. The weight that goes with the tripod and actually stabilizes. You get um, smoother videos that way. Lovely little travel case. Um, the Pivo itself. An action mount if you have an action camera. I do not, um, but I do have a smartphone. And so they gave me the smart mount as well. So I'm gonna be using this one, but I'll show you guys what this one looks like too. So here is the tripod. Pretty easy to set up actually. Even one-handed, as I am demonstrating here. So you're gonna flip the legs, opposite of how they came. Like so. And you lock it back into place. Okay, well you start with the bottom lock. And then your Pivo gets screwed onto the top there. It's not a toy smoky. please don't eat it. All right, so the other part that goes with the tripod is gonna be the weight, which is kind of a really cool idea. So, this is designed, okay, I'm just gonna have to tear this apart like a monster. This is what my husband always tells me when I open up potato chip bags. Apparently, I open them like a monster opens potato chip bags, so. I don't know if anybody else out there has that same talent. <laughs> All right, so this goes actually around the neck of the tripod and you put bottles of water in there to stabilize it, which is kind of a cool idea, especially if you're riding like me in Florida where it is always hot. It's very handy. All right, next up, we've got the travel case, which is extremely handy because otherwise I would probably lose all of this stuff in my vehicle somewhere. So this is neat. Nice little travel case to keep everything where you need it so you don't get to the barn and find out that you forgot, I don't know, your actual Pivo. And speaking of, here is the actual Pivo pod. Kind of cool. Also something that I discovered is if you don't have a tripod, this has little legs that come out like that. There's three of them so that it'll stabilize it if you're just setting it on a surface tabletop or mounting block or something like that. And then we've got the charging cable and remote control and a manual. Oh, I'm dropping boxes on the floor. Oh, my supervisor's coming. Shoot. Oh, I'm going to get in trouble for that. Right. Little charging cable. Pretty standard. This is where it hooks up. And remote control. That's super handy when you're mounted on the horse. All right. I'm going to open up the action mount even though I don't have an action camera so I'm going to be using the smart mount but I'll just open it so everybody can see what it looks like. Comes in this nice little tray 
which again would be much easier for me to get out of here if I had the use of both hands, but that's why I got the Pivo. So here you go. So what you would do is you would unscrew the top of this Pivo here and replace it with this guy. And then this opens to clamp down on your smartphone and then you mount your action camera to the top and use this guy right here to close it. So if I had an action camera, I would be doing that, but I do not. I am a minimalist and I have a smartphone and that's all you really need to use this. All right, so again, this, this also has this adjustable, actually bottom and top adjust to clamp onto your smartphone. And the good thing about this I mean, you don't need it to use the Pivo. You can just put your smartphone right in here and this little back clamps down on it and that works fine. The good thing about this guy is that you can actually point it down or up. So depending on what you have your tripod set at or if you've got it on a surface that's not the tripod, this can come in handy. Um, or, you know, like me, I ride a pony, so like, yeah, I'll be putting it down this way. Those of you who have the big warm bloods, maybe you can uh, point it up here. <laughs> Obviously, I'm over-exaggerating, but you get the point. So, this is the mess that I've created in my kitchen now. But that's okay, because my husband's not home yet, so i got time to clean it up. And, yeah, I, I'm excited to, to get this thing charged up tonight and then take it to the barn tomorrow and try it out.